This is Pitar, and uh, today I'll be doing the crossbow explosive tip. Now this is a box gun, so the price of the gun in and out of itself is 950, but it's probably going to run you up a little more than that because, again, random box weapon, so you have to get it out of the random box. And I do suggest holding on to this unless you get a ray gun or a kind of wonder weapon that can be your emergency backup more quickly because in order for the crossbow to be worth anything you need to upgrade it but once it's upgraded I tell you there is there is no gun quite like it because it's very fast very reliable gets you out of sticky situations better than even the wonder Waff. the only gun that's on par with this weapon I'd have to say is the thunder gun because it it's just very 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 useful because, again, it's 13 monkey bombs, and you can reload them and shoot them very quickly. The only downside to this weapon is that it doesn't affect dogs, monkeys, pyros, astronauts. You get the idea. The only kinds of zombies it affects are the uh, everyday round zombies. It won't affect any kind of extra zombies, and that includes Romero. Romero is not affected by it either. For our first perk, I'd have to say the essential juggernaut again for the extra health against fighting zombies and so that the explosion is less likely to down you when you're tapping in combination with the explosion. Our second perk would have to be speed cola since the crossbow only holds one shot at a time. Our third perk is just to make sure that last little explosion doesn't kill you if you're beat red with one health left. So PhD Flopper is a great choice if you can get it. Our fourth perk would have to be Mule Kick because once you swap to the crossbow, no matter which how many times you have to hit Y, it's not going to let you down. You just shoot it, reload, and then run off. So you can afford to get that third weapon and make as much money as you need to. However, if you can't get PhD Flopper because of the map you're on, I would suggest Quick Revive because Quick Revive will let you get other teammates who are down up very easily because you can just shoot the crossbow in a place where they can get around the zombies, get them up, and then use it continuously to get them out of trouble and you out of trouble as well. The crossbow has an infinite number of uses in getting both you and other players out of sticky situations because of how very quickly you shoot it. Monkey bombs take quite a lot of time, but with the crossbow, you can get out of any situation with these.